So we are back over here at the hoarder locker getting another load. Found uh found some cool stuff to look through. Oh, opened up. Buddy L motorized steel drivers. Original packaging. This, there's honey guys in there. I think there's some baseball cards in that one. So we're going to get one load before it gets dark out. Ugh. And get the heck out of here. We just uh went through the truck from the last load found like another i don't know like 35 dollars or something cash a lot of sellable stuff so at least try and get some of these boxes out here today so. see what we find what was it Nintendo? Back to the future Nintendo? Double dribble Nintendo? Techno ball? Huh? Hmm? Oh, uh, Techno ball, Back to the future, and something else on NES. Star Trek dolls, Shelly. Let's see what's in there. Let's see what I'm standing on. <laughs> Did I learn from the microwave? No. Star Trek dolls from Shelly. <gasps> oh, there's Midge's clothing. Not even a doll. There's not even a doll. Shelly took my dolls. I think it's uh, dwarf clothes. Or no, the sheets. No Star Trek in there. Look, I finally made it to the back wall. Back wall. So, sitting here talking to Neil, thought of something. I said this once before on this locker. This is what they don't show you on TV. You have any idea how many newspapers we pulled out of this locker? At least enough to fill, what, half of a 30 yard dumpster so far if it was just newspapers? Yeah. yeah. I, still more. Probably about 20 yards worth of newspapers. Hey, we had newspaper lamps right here. Just newspaper. We looked through them. We haven't found any money inside. Well, Neil found 50 cents and with one bag of newspapers out of all the ones we looked through. <laughs> newspapers. Used takeout containers. Oh, used takeout containers. We got boxes and boxes of used takeout containers. There's a suitcase full of like milk jugs and uh, Gatorade bottles. And... Yeah. So look at this uh, leaning tower of tables. So three tables and how many chairs are in that tower? Three tables? What is this thing? Ooh, I don't know what that is. It's like three and a half tables and six or seven chairs in that leaning tower of kitchen furniture. <laughs> We're afraid to touch it. Here, look at it. Used containers, boxes of that stuff. What's in this one? Everywhere they went, they VHS stayed, like, tapes. brochures. There was like that, they stayed at a Marriott before. There's anything to do with a Marriott, napkins, the little menus. Menus from takeout places. Yeah, yeah. The, uh, pa Ponderosa. And Mr. Steak. Old Mr. Steak from Naperville. I guess it doesn't exist anymore. Yeah. Lots of their menus. Though. There's a box of uh, phone books from 2000. So, just be yeah. We got phone books. Phone books, yo. Just because you see a locker that looks nice and clean and it's full boxes, doesn't mean it's all gold and treasures. You it's not going to use newspapers. Don't it's um, it could be this where it's just mostly crap. Yeah, we're finding some cash. We found 
a little over a hundred dollars of cash so far a little bit yeah we found 65 the one day like 30 the, another day and then today we found what like five or six and a bunch of change so a little over a hundred dollars in cash so far nothing to like you know write home about so uh, yes <laughs> yes there are treasures in here like we just found those nes boxes i haven't looked through them yet but could be some very serious potential there uh found that eight track player the other day found atari games, atari games yeah. found a computer that might be worth something and it works too so ton of work would i buy this locker again no i wouldn't knowing what's in here i would not buy it again just not worth the, the trouble worth the work but who knows maybe there's something still hiding in here whole corner we didn't get to yet well, we made it pretty far i remember we couldn't even step one foot in this locker when we started like what a week ago yeah, yeah so we made it pretty far so in order to try and get some some of these more boxes in the truck today and get out of here so if i find something else i'll show you if i don't maybe i'll still show you I'm tired all right this is where we're stopping for today I got to see what's in the corner, so I'm happy, but disappointed. Two chairs sitting on top of what looks like two dressers. And this is all newspaper. I don't want to see another newspaper for as long as I live. This is ridiculous. So besides the 20 or so boxes of newspaper left in here, it's mostly furniture. So I'll see if we can donate most of this. That'd be nice if we can. Do a load with the box truck and donate it all. All right, let's get out of here. I'm tired, I'm hungry. Make a nice movie prop for somebody. I thought this guy was pretty cool. Maxell uh, window shade. It's a pretty cool piece, actually. I could see someone really wanting that. All right, get the rest of this stuff in the truck and call it a day. Made a lot of progress, that's for sure. It's probably the last video I do here. I don't think there's much more to see in this locker. If I find anything interesting in the few boxes I pulled out, I'll show you. But I think we're just gonna focus on getting this one taken care of. I gotta get it taken care of before the end of the month so I don't have to pay another 300 and something dollars to run it. Actually, it only cost me 50 to run it because a uh, dollar moving, so. Whew. All right. Love. See you guys later.